Hello everybody, it's me, Erli. I'm doing like a sneaky stream, see if I can do it because uh, Lufi is at work and the baby, I just put him down to sleep after feeding him. So I'll check on him every 20 minutes or so, so I'll just like hop off to there. But um, unless he cries or like spits up, it should be alright. But yeah, um, I'm going to try stream even though Lufi is at work. But of course, baby is the priority if he needs anything. So let's just try and get as much done as possible before the baby wakes up and remember to check on him. Oh right, I'm in this area. There's lots of quests in Rebellion. this area. Oh, hello. Awkward. So let's clear the goblin encampments. I had work today too, just a little bit, so that was fun. Like, I One less human to like, worry about. kind of think my job is a little easy, like I, I was kind of nervous about going back and it, it was really easy for me, so I was actually really happy and happy to see all my students. So I guess that means I chose a good job for me, if that's the kind of job I enjoy so much that I was happy to be back. One of Ranrock's camps, exactly as Madame Beaumont described. Wizards are running scared! Oh. Dodging? Oh my goodness. Where are you? Oh. Yay! Your blood from Banrock's hands. Yeah, I prefer dodging to using triangle for some reason. Even though that would probably be better for me. To use the shield and perhaps stupefy them, you know? I think maybe the unreliability of stupefy for me kind of puts me off. Oops. Oops. Well, that's one encampment. What are they mining? There was a sack of something over here. Oh, there. Oh, right. Because Lufi is not here, he can't check the sound. So let me just check that. It would be awful if I did this one stream and no one could hear me. So, live. Can I view? Hello? Hello? Oh, okay, good. It's fine. Phew! That would have been awkward. It's happened to me before, so... Rebellion. What's in here? Oh. Ooh! Okay, next encampment. It's sad that character's brother died, though. And that I kind of killed him. But he was an inferi, so he wasn't exactly coming back to life. Officer alive to the rescue. 
I really love sneaking around and using the square. How nice of you to stop by. Oh, there's an ancient thingy. I need those. Where are they? Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Can they see me on the other side of this? Why is a grapple you are? to worry about. Oh, oh. Uh-oh. You will regret coming here. Uh-oh. Afraid to fight? I'm actually not afraid to fight. Oh, I got that one. Ah! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, he fell on my head. Ah! 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 Okay, okay. Got it. They all suddenly spawned around me, so I couldn't do my sneak. Madame Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Interesting giant diggy machine. Ooh. Rebellion. Why can't I eat this? Maybe it's made of humans. Chicken humans. Hmm. Nothing around here? Okay. We return to Claire Beaumont after I do this castle. Because it has an ancient thingy. Oh, here we go. It always freaks me out how it like grabs your legs. Oh? Revelio. Okay, we gotta get inside then. Ooh, I How do I get it? Down there maybe? Oh! Is it only an exit maybe? Okay. I never know why we do that. I think it reveals something, but I don't know. Why. How do I get inside? Do I just fly in? Ooh. Oh! Oh! Okay. Whoa! Some gloves. Mm 
Maybe it was already possible to climb up this ladder. Oh, but see, now I'm outside again. How do I get the one in there? Up here. Am I supposed to jump down there? It seems dangerous. Okay. I don't like it because it looks like it hurts her. Ooh. Here we go. If only Professor Fig could have seen that. I think that unlocked something. Yeah, challenge complete. Oh, gear slots are full. Okay, yeah, I'm supposed to slide down out here. Hmm. Okay, so let's return to clear. Is this leading me to clear? Say if there's something you need. Hmm, my gear slots are full, so. Oh, a top hat? I didn't realize I had a top hat. Anything that doesn't have any special thing on it, I should probably just sell. Because hmm. I can just, um, wear it anyway. Thanks for buying all my clothes that I stole. Like in this game they explain a lot, like you have the Hogwarts like book that helps you find pages and tells you about the world and it's like, wow, you explained a game mechanic using the magic of the world? That's so cool. And they do it with some other things. And then when it comes to finding like treasure and loot, it's just like you steal from everyone and no one notices. It's like, oh, okay. It couldn't have been like you find dropped gifts of Niffler or something like that, you know? Jumping over the fences. Oh, there's a beast thing? What animal's over here? I think I'm almost full though. Hmm. Oh. What animal is hiding? Some weird frog. No, no, this one. Oh, I just stole a frog. I'm not going to <laughs> Nine out of ten. Only one more beast I can catch. They should expand it though, I want more beasts than this. I don't even want the materials, I just like them. Hmm. I should probably save since I caught an animal. And I feel like that's like something that you don't want to lose because they're all unique. Like when I play Pokemon, I don't say very much except for when I catch one and then I'm like, I can't lose you. I've thought of a name for you and everything. Nice. 
Additional capacity added to your ancient magic meter. That that's a good reward. Now I need six more. That's annoying. Mm. Yeah. I do miss the bustle Now will you become a store? Podcast. Hello, Madam Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? Magic. I managed to catch them off guard. Oh, I wish my brother could have done what you did. Perhaps he'd still be with me now. Mm. I'm especially grateful. You did for Bardolf what I could not. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. Yay! What do you have for sale? What are you looking for exactly? Thank oh. you. I do appreciate what you went through to find my brother. I don't need Thank any you. Of those. I could always use more of these. Oh, my like good. passing through. Mm. Oh, hello. I can't well, believe it. what happened to Bardos. My poor brother. An inferior. Oh, it's outside? Oh, one of those monkeys. Can only get them at daytime. Whoa, it's bright. I mean, at night time. Hmm. Oh, yeah, is this the area that has the giant creature? Can I jump in this water? Whoa! Okay, I can get out of the water. Okay. Mm. Oh yay! Ooh, we need to go to the room of requirement. Oh oh, maybe I'm not meant to go there. Okay. Yay! I have three bars for my ancient magic meter now. Better than mine? Mm. Oh yeah, I need to make my clothes better as well. But first I should put on the best clothes. Plus 10? I don't have Crucio, but that's still good. Watch out for me. Hmm. Oh, plus 
Increase spell damage while concealed by disillusionment. Mm, I'm usually not concealed by the time I do that though. I don't have Bombarda though. Oh, I must have put something on that myself. But yeah, this offense is really good. And Expelliarmus trait. You see, it's up by one, but this one has decreased damage taken by from Doug Box. Oh, yeah, I use that all the time. That's great. So I really like the outfit I have, and I really like the scarf that I have. So maybe we can upgrade those. Mm. These all have things on them now, though, and I kind of want to change the things that are on them. Okay, so I'm wearing this one. So let's... Can I change the traits? View upgrade. Hmm. I would like to do that. This is in this is the one I'm wearing, right? Yeah. Oh, I see. Interesting. That's why you have to switch your animals around, but I don't want to switch my animals around. Mm. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I just got a, like, toad frog thingy. I could do that. That'd be cool. Let's see, what else have I got on? I, see, I don't have Bombarda. See, is it possible to change the traits? Oh, looks like it is. Hmm. That would be good. be really nice. Ah, too powerful for this item. Oh, I get it. Okay. I like maybe this one. Hmm. Okay, that's cool. See, I should check on the baby. But maybe we can watch the animals play outside? So please excuse me while I check on the baby. peacefully he sleeps like this with his arms up very cute but um yeah I just have to make sure he doesn't turn himself around and try and stick his legs through the bars and then I quickly remembered I bought ice cream and I had to make sure it was in the freezer oh hello my buddies hi okay here you go 
Would you like some too? Here you go. Who's gonna eat the fastest? There you go, Prina. See, I think you're supposed to like prioritize the ones that you want to collect things from. But I just want them to live here and be happy. Why why can't they all just live here and be happy? So cute. This is Lufaya the Niffler. Here you go. Here is my unicorn and puffle buns. Hi. Here you are, puffle buns. Here you are, Lancelot. Or as Lufaya called him, Lancelot. <laughs> Here you go. You're safe here. Just give me your materials. Ooh, thank you. Oh, puffle buns. Maybe I'll put you away and get that uh, the toad out. I'm sorry, puffle buns. Wait, all oh, right, Mookie's not out here. Where's Erelai the Niffler? Erelai the Niffler. Oh, she must be over here. Erelai. It's Lufire. Oh, Prina's above me. You rely the Niffler, you're over here. Oh, there she is. Hello! I maybe would have wanted to be the um, blue one, but it, the blue one's a boy and the yellow one's a girl. So. There you go. Oh, so cute. <laughs> Okay, so let's manage animals. We're gonna let Puffle Buns come out so that we can get the materials from this frog. I don't want to do that. I just want to expand it. These are my friends. Professor Helen will never believe this. Oh, it's a girl one. Oh, it's a girl frog. <gasps> Hello, I'm scared. Here you go, eat food, please. Don't eat me. I'm gonna brush you now. And now collect your warts. Oh my goodness. Your name to make me less scared of you is Bloopy. Here you go, Bloopy. You can hang out here today. And then I might have to switch you because you terrify me. But I think I can do that upgrade on my outfit now. I think that's what I needed. That would be cool to get that much of a boost. Oh, okay. What needed it? Was it you? Was it you? No, it wasn't. It was one that I put it on. This one. See? I can do it. Ooh, what a strong outfit. Wow, look at all the things you need. Hippogriff feather. I think I know where the hippogriffs are. I should probably catch one. Yeah, now my outfit's too strong. I won't want to change it with anything. 
Luckily you can change the look of it, so I'm not even wearing it right now. I'm wearing like this mermaid armor that was given to me for helping out with a mermaid quest. So let's go to the quest log and accept something. Oh. Um. Hmm. Oh. Oh right. Yeah, that just happens over time. A lot of these just happen over time. This one, I'm waiting for the suggested level. The detailing keys happens over time with finding them. Oh yeah, I need to do the broom trial, which I'm not good at. I gotta. Oh. Oh, I have to go find the letters for that person, and I have to find those, and then I don't know where this is leading me, so I've tried looking at it, and I've tried finding the bridge, but there's so many bridges, like the, it's very vague, so let's go to astronomy class, up here, okay. oh, I'm very close by. Am I like right next door to it maybe? Yeah, astronomy tower. Perfect. Okay. Ravenia. Where's the treasure chest? Oh. What was Peeve sliding down? Was it one of these? But yeah, time to actually go to class. Wait. Oh, that's interesting. This class needs to be at night time? That's cool. The others I had to wait till daytime. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Oh, am I late? Ladies, Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescope. You, you can't find your future in deck. your teacup. It's in the stars, of course. But I love, like, real astronomy. I love the stars. Still, you don't have your own. You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share Thanks. with Mr. Takar. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no, bring it into focus on your own. This feels a bit like The Sims. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from Finally, which they Finally, they're gonna tell me how to use those! On the very self -same I get it, I needed a telescope. That's why Is I couldn't that use them. Oh, I'm so excited. Finally. I love it when they finally Dismiss. unlock something that you've seen so much, and there's a lot of that in this game, which means that you're not like disappointed that you've Hello. found out too early. I don't believe and now we've met over, officially. You know? I I'm love Amit. not knowing. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. I have a boyfriend, but hmm. That's very kind of you, Emmett. Mm. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. 
It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. Ooh. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Oh. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Yeah. Well, I. Thank you, Rabbit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some. Uh, Giving Sebastian a for his money. to finish money. on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Ooh. Avelio. Stargazing as long as I could. Not sure what you can learn from these astronomy tables that you can't learn from a cup of tea leaves. Yeah, exactly. Probably nothing from either. The perfect night for. Oh, hello again. Hi. What? Okay, where is the storage room? I thought I was following the instructions. I guess I was not. I didn't realize there was a storage area to get to from here. Oh. They hid the staircase and then got mad at me for not finding it. Ooh. Oh. This was his old telescope. Looks practically brand new. Hmm. Ah, a pristine night for stargazing. I did that test test kind of thing with um if like Google is listening or something and I said the word telescope and like yeah I got tons of ads for telescopes on like Facebook and stuff. And then another time I like thought a word and I said I would not say that word, I'd only think it. And then I got lots of ads for that. It was very weird. I have the telescope. It's nicer than I had expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Yes? What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here there at is. Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. <gasps> I wonder if that's one of the challenges. Cool. Well, I'm just glad he's not asking for anything bad. And you need someone to help you find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Aww. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Weird. Let us get moving Sounds while the fun. stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Let's go. Will you walk next to me? Oh, no need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? It's spooky. The Thank table goodness. is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. He we'll know it when we see it. Either. Onwards we go. Some say the locations hey. of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Oh, I have seen centaurs. Oh my goodness. You're so fast. <sighs> it is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Like, I suppose How that's a good here? excuse to go out at to night alone with a girl. Then. But it's kind of creepy to be out here. It's not that creepy out here at night, <gasps> is it? The gobs don't... Here I am, charging ahead. Mm. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. Should be up on the top. Ooh, mm. boxes. A little foreboding. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh yeah, about. I have been here. Oh, of course. 
It's just not as tidy as I expected. Astronomy isn't tidy. Ooh. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Oh, no. Not this close to the school, Emmett. So he's a coward too. The music sounded scary. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Oh, I see. about the tables they really are gateways to the far stars just as the book said and your contribution was invaluable rest assured Yay. you shall be credited in my memoirs one day thank you Emmett I look forward to reading them and I look forward to writing them <laughs> this is only the Baby's beginning crying. you will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer and if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Oh. Thank you. It's you very windy there, apparently. It has goblin-cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's yeah. all in the throat, really, gobbledygook. You know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. He's just flirting uh -huh. constantly. Anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. How is he leaving? <laughs> Ooh, cool. Okay, I have to check on my baby because he's crying. And if he needs, like, a lot of attention, I'll obviously have to go. So, just enjoy the night sky. <laughs> Never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view. It's one of those tables Professor Shaw mentioned. Okay. <laughs> he needs a little more attention than I thought. Here he is. Here he is. Hi. <laughs> yeah. He sped up all on his outfit, so he needs his outfit to be changed. So, I will stop for now. <laughs> 
and if he goes back to sleep, I'll hop back on. I know there's a pause broadcast button, but I don't know if how that works properly yet. So, and I wouldn't want it to, uh, like, people to be annoyed, I guess. But yeah, I'm gonna look after him a little bit, and we'll see if I come back. Bye. Bye, bye. Yeah. Let's see. Do, do.